Oh, I will take five division six. I forgot actually that Erwin, no, Heinz Guderian is actually leading a force up here with uh, the intent of taking the world, no, but by using tank forces to, to push through. Someone is banking something in the background, it's really annoying me. Please stop. They're doing it louder too, it's like they heard me. Is it my, in my background or yours? No, it's in my background. Oh, I'm not hearing anything. Well, I'm pretty sure it will be audible in the recording, but yeah. Yeah, I have this Actually, with music. all of this, I, I, I just can't be bothered to do individual plans here. I will just add them all to the general plan. Let's put them under Gerd von Rundstedt, who's still, like, he has 238 divisions under his command at the moment. Not actually counting the divisions from Romania and Hungary that will join in as well. I have, and he still thinks that the enemy is stronger. I have terrible attrition on my units in West Africa. Well, how many units do you have there? Didn't you send a million men? Kind of. Yeah, so that could explain that. How's the West going? This is going surprisingly okay. Uh, let's see how many men have... I lost 466,000. You have lost 594,000. You actually have 241 divisions at the moment. How the hell did you manage that? What? I have 93, according to... Oh, hang on. Are... Am I in... No, but I have 93 divisions. It says that you have a lot more than that. Did you accept... Like, do you have a puppet that you can get troops from? Yeah. Quite possibly. Or did you accept uh, troops from like Hungary or whatever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it, because uh, technically, when I hold over, like when I just zoom out on like Bohemian Empire, Hungary, Romania, Bulgaria, th then there's like probably hundred divisions there, more than that. Oh. All right. well, How many did you say? That. Like two hundred? Uh, said two hundred and forty-one divisions. Yeah, that makes up. I, I think that the others have about one hundred and forty. Yeah. <laughs> So, that was the answer to that mystery. Yeah. That now is no mystery anymore. There we go. So perhaps we can sign a leader here. Let's take the best of the best, Maximilian von Weichs, who will be in charge of this plan. So spread out the units and then uh, do a mission to take all of Norway if you would be so kind. But apparently we can't take all of Norway, but we, we can't even take parts of Norway. How many men do, does Norway even have? How many divisions? I want to know. It's for science. 9 to 15. Holy shit. How is this possible? Okay, perhaps we shouldn't make any, any plans. Perhaps I should do it manually. Like the good old days. In the good old days, you didn't have any fancy plans, so you have to do it yourself. Oh, some of these are Czech troops. Check, check, check. I don't know what's uh, going on with my battle planner now, again. I'm, I'm having... Oh, this is going terrible. Uh, delete order, but I can't really see... There are no units assigned to this order, what? But there is... Oh, chaos. Oh, but hang on. Okay, we'll do a new front line. I'm just speaking out loud because that's how I like to do things. That's what I do almost all the time. There we go. Okay, and execute. Okay, now we have a battle plan. Okay, good. good, good. Basically, that that is, you know, you stuff on YouTube. Speaking out loud. <laughs> yeah, thinking, thinking before you some, speak. Pretend, pretending well, I mean, someone speaking will listen. Before you think. <laughs> Again, I did what I said. Uh, oh, th this is going so slow. It's like my units barely don't listen to me. Maybe they don't. It's quite oh, evident that they don't. It's just insane the amount of dish. Then now, you know the little thing in Equatorial Guinea that belongs to Spain? Uh, now, kind like of. right next to Congo, right next to Belgium. Mm -hmm. There's 19 divisions there of, uh, of Spanish troops now. And more are just pouring in. Pour it on them! Yes. To quote Men of War. Ah, yeah, what's that for Men of War? I think it was, Very yeah. New. The Americans who also ye yell, For Uncle Sam! Oh yeah, Uncle Sam. I mean, he's the most famous of them all. 
Yeah, he was the one who founded America, I think, if in yes. 1655. <laughs> sure. I mean, yeah. that sounds right to me. So I love how you've had so much trouble with the Swedes, and now again they have like territory technically in, uh, you know, yeah, blue blob. Yeah, they are annoying. They, they shall be annoying. victorious. Well, we shall be victorious. They shall not. I mean, the Norwegians from. What I see, I just have to try to take the older territory. Like, I need to take Narvik and I need to take Bergen. And when I take Bergen, Narvik, I already have taken Trondheim and I have Oslo, so that should finish them off. I, like, this reminds me of in Hearts of Iron Free, where it's hilarious that Oslo is the only thing you need to take and all of Norway collapses. Here it's a bit harder than that. Yeah. You need to take at least four different points before. The Norwegians give up. And oh yeah, I forgot the Norwegians are actually fighting against the Soviets at the same time. No! And the Soviet Union declared war on Turkey. Terrible. They're just going. Yeah. They're going to town on this. They but, are. By the way, I want to inform you that I'm working on my war with the USSR, natural focus. Mm -hmm. And I'm 23 days away. Oh, interesting. Uh, this is slightly worrying because I would have liked to have Turkey. Oh, now we're but fighting I, against Turkey. I, I was just too late. The thing in Africa took too long and has taken too much effort, and it's basically all America's fault. And uh, yeah. Yeah, but now we are at war with Turkey. Yeah, are we? <laughs> yes, we are. They are part of the Allies now, right? Yes. Okay. So well, they, they uh, got called into the war against us. Maybe Let's I will send them. my two paratrooper divisions and my tank division there. You should. I mean, three divisions. I don't know how long. I look can last. forward to seeing your success. As much as I'm looking forward to seeing your success in Africa overall. Yeah, well, me too. So, never done. Pretty much. I mean. Let's see. Oh, there we go. And then move one and move one and. That. That's it. There we go. So yeah, I'm I'm worried about the invasion of of Russia or Soviet Union. I really am. But yeah. I'm as well prepared as can be for the moment, and I have a ton of divisions ready. And it's a year late to the party. I like that um, the combined Yugoslavian, Spanish, and. Uh, Wait, is this Italy? Oh yeah, you've got an all of of Bulgaria strips. That's why Bulgaria is doing nothing. Have you noticed that, by the way? Yeah, I I, I just thought I had access to them, but maybe I do have. You do control them because okay. if I hold over the divi uh, divisions, it says Italy underneath. Bulgaria, you say? Yes, Dionaris Bulgaria. <laughs> well, to Istanbul we go. Yes. Oh crap. I I uh, bumped into Turks. No, 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 no. Oh, terrible, terrible. <laughs> How can I be in trouble in Turkey? I never thought that would happen. Uh, Especially when Turkey is at the same time fighting against the Soviets. And Iran is also fighting against Soviets. Oh, yeah, and I forgot about, about the Japanese that are fighting against uh, the British Raj. And it's not going... Oh, yeah. They still haven't finished that. Which is shocking to me. Yeah, the Dorsets have, well, 36 divisions there in the north. What the hell? And I love that the French have uh, Saigon as their capital. <laughs> do they? Yeah. Well, they're forced to do something. Well, Vichy there France. We go. I've taken Bergen, so that means that it's only... <laughs> Reorganized nationalist China. Fantastic title for a country. We're yes, reorganized yes. now. It's different. It's different this time. Yeah, but how under is Japanese this rule. possible? Ask an expert, perhaps. <sighs> but I can tell you one thing. It's only 12 days away from war with the USSR. Born in the USFA. I don't really what's know the, what's, what's the song called? Born in the... Well, born in the USA is... Uh, Bruce Springsteen, no. but Wait, there's also I like one I'm... called uh, Back in the USSR by the Beatles. Mm. I was referring to some other song by someone called Greenwood, I don't know, something about American. <laughs> it was all American, 
Like, it's incredibly patriotic song. But for some reason, I, I like it. So my capture of uh, Dakar isn't going fantastic. I sort of tried to reorganize and make a battle plan that only made things worse, actually. Reorganize, like China? Uh, no, reorganize my battle plan. Oh. Well, over here, it seems like I've managed to limit their advance somewhat, but it's not going extremely well, unfortunately. I've told them to be extremely aggressive, but for some reason they don't seem to believe me or listen to me. How is six divisions assigned to that order? How about we all assign them to you instead? This is just silly. I mean Freetown. Freetown should not be a thing. It will be called Nazi Town when I'm done. <laughs> I like how you said that, like Brad Pitt in uh, Inglorious Bastards or something. I still have not watched that movie. Don't. It's terrible. Terrible. <gasps> no. I've heard uh, many, many great things about that movie. Now you've heard now a you terrible, terrible thing. Now it's just like, you know, it, I know it's like meant to be funny and like, you know, cool like that or something, but it's just, I, I get too annoyed as a history nerd. Well, maybe you shouldn't take offense at movies. Oh, not really taking offense though, but I can still be annoyed, can I? No, you're not allowed to be annoyed. Okay, I see how it goes. Well, my so Bulgarian goes. friends are doing pretty well against Istanbul. Yeah, but I'm trying to figure out why the hell. I mean, the Norwegians apparently are only. That wasn't even a word. <laughs> uh, the Norwegians, for some reason, still think they are something and I don't like it no but I have taken pretty much every single town they have that is a victory point yet they say I don't control enough victory points for them to capitulate interesting sentiment. That. where where the hell is their capital then if I have taken all of this and yet like if I look at them Norway 81% towards capitulation it controls 31% of its victory points 31% where the hell is that that is, I control that. They don't control anything else. Have they taken anything in my land? Have they made a naval invasion a la Sweden? No, they have not. Does Norway could, you know, own anything beyond what I can see? Mm. I mean, they don't have any other national focus or victory points that I can see. Not a single bloody one of them. No, I'm trying to look, but no. <laughs> Not Jan Mayen, surely, no. No. I mean, I own all the victory points, yet for some reason it says I don't. Hmm. And now I am slightly bent out of shape. But it doesn't matter, they are effectively capitulated. So, you war with the USSR, 20th of August 1943. Just a terrible time for the war, really. Yeah, going into autumn, winter, yeah. But what can you do when... Uh, when they come for you. Declare war, annex, yes, annex the Soviet Union. Hmm. Yeah. That seems reasonable. Surely that so let's go for that much war score. Oh, here we go. Let's call the Syrian natural state as our ally. Let's call the Lebanon free state as our ally. The German Reich has declared war. So how do you stand? I the accept. The German Reich has called Italy as our ally. Yeah, with Italy on our side, we cannot lose. Said no one ever. Yeah. I think that it's sentence really has no never one. been uttered <clears throat> until now. I don't, until now. I was the first one ever. So, Gerd von Rundstedt, get on with it. Get on with your plan and now lower time uh, because uh, things will happen. Oh shit, uh, that was a bunch of stuff. The whole world declared war on each other and their mothers. Yes, and their mothers, fathers, and their fathers, mothers, and everyone else in between. And if you look on the, on, uh, the Eastern Front, it just erupted into warfare. I like that word, or like, I like that sentence. That word, huh? And now in the Baltic states, they do have some airplanes. They actually are trying to challenge us. And they're doing the same thing in Eastern Poland, but I don't think they will be very successful. And Japan wants to join us, so we have Japan Ooh, on our side. excellent. Will they actually do something? That remains to be seen. I doubt it. I very much doubt it. But I will uh, try to import some from Venezuela. I need... Oil. Yeah, I was dependent on them for oil, which was stupid. 
so maybe now I have enough oil. <laughs> Germany oh, breaks Molotov you know? Ribbentrop Pact, really? And it was a bit late, but sure. Well, yeah. Um, so you know, hi. Things um, are going to go to shit now. They have a lot of divisions. The Soviets have a lot of divisions. They have 470 to 907 divisions. Holy shit. That is a lot. Yeah. And I've lost nine, 19 men so far. While the Soviets have lost 7,000. Hmm. So, so far, so good, really. So perhaps we can even increase the speed a little bit. Uh, but now airplanes are just swarming over all of the world. For no reason. Perhaps we can force the Soviets away. Perhaps we can break through the lines. Holy shit, the amount of divisions on this freaking front. It's just insane. I haven't even... Oof. You should take a look. Yeah, this is, I, uh, I, I just took a look and my computer whipped. Bloody wonderful. Yes, it, your computer will weep if you reach these territories. But now, I mean... Oh shit. This is just insane. Try to move through here. Perhaps I will just I, sh I should redo my my front line. I will I will do more ambitious goal than this. Mostly because I don't think it really is working out too well so far. So remove this invasion plan. Let's go for an invasion plan, including pretty much all of the Soviet Union. There we go, and they're off. And let's go aggressively. There we go. Now go aggressive and punish them all for their insolence. Holy shit. How's it going in Africa? <sighs> Unclear. Oh god, we've gotten isolated. What happened? I mean, yeah, I, I, did, I made a battle plan that was perfectly clear. Or like, you know, I try. I, I, so because controlling individual divisions wasn't really helping me at all. It was just going very slow. Uh, and now things are going bananas. So I preferred mm, slow bananas. to bananas, really. But bananas are good. Good for you as well. They're for monkeys. Uh, no. Yeah, so seriously, I, I don't really know what to do. I'm, I'm concerned about the West African... Because it's never getting solved. It's just like the grind or so. Well, yeah, um, but... I mean, at least we're keeping them there, so as I long guess, as they're kept, I, guess I, I will be happy. I guess I'll just have to try to annihilate the Norwegian armies and, you know, and occupy the rest of the territory here. Problem is, there will be a fight in northern Norway as well against, uh, against them. Why are they... stop doing that. I don't want to hear it. Perhaps they're annoyed by my voice. Maybe that's why they're doing it. That might be that might be a perfectly valid reason. I, I don't understand yeah. how you can have surprising success in Liberia with like two divisions, whereas my tens of divisions are having troubles with uh, well everything they try to accomplish, pretty much. I don't know either, really. Um, and, and you know, know. there like no orders are getting through. I'm also wondering if this is bugged because I am not able to move any of my divisions. It's useless. I think it's mostly due to resource problems. I think you have far too many divisions, really. Yeah, but if I don't have this many divisions, the enemy will outnumber me vastly. So it's like, well, you know, pick your poison. Yeah, but then, well, I think the problem right now that you have is that you have too many divisions so you will not get enough supplies so your number is useless but not enough divisions H hello i have a half of what like spain has for example well spain's like spain's divisions are like one division of spanish troops are like uh, you know a fifth of anyone else's troops yeah so their divisions consist of far 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 less men like one one spanish division okay to illustrate they could have one thousand men while your division has ten thousand men each yeah, alright. So I think that's what's causing it. 